Hello everybody, my name is Luchara, and this is Across the Obelisk, another episode of my Let's Play series. We are currently in the Spider Cave, trying to make our way out, climbing cobwebs. After resting for a while and collecting all the useful items, the only thing left to do is to get out of the cave. From the ceiling of the cave, you see a hole through which some light enters. You think you can get out of the cave if you climb up the cobwebs and reach the hole. Let's do that. Okay. <laughs> that was pretty simple. Alright, so here we are. So yeah, we got one more fight, and then it's boss time, so uh... Let's do this. Easy corruption. Each hero will be able to remove one card. We don't have any negative cards, so that's meh. Heal for 30% max. We're already full. So I really don't see a reason to do this. Because these monsters are fairly tough. Uh, especially, I hate these two in the back. They're annoying. We're going we're gonna to make sure they die. We're going to make sure they don't get a turn. Well, <laughs> nice hand. Everything costs zero, and it's all front monsters. So yeah, I guess we'll just uh, guess we'll just crack, <laughs> crack this guy, and a defend, and an intercept, and carry over five energy till next turn. All right, <laughs> good job. All right, so hit this back one, and hit the back one. I should probably should have ricocheted first for the mark. That's my bad. Okay, that's okay. And then we'll do a smoke bomb. So they can't really do anything on their turn. Oh, that's too bad. I guess he can buff. And another buff. Alright, we really like to kill this back one. What we got here? Okay, so Shadow Bolt. That's a lot of damage, but that costs three. All I can do... Hmm. Yeah, there's no real good options here. I guess I could do a flare. Get one back. So now I could do a shadow bolt if I wanted, or a fireball. If I do a fireball, that's it. I mean, I can do fire blast regardless. Yeah, let's. Hmm. It's got a lot of resist to that, though. She's got a lot of resist. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. That. There. I don't need... I don't need to draw much damage, but I do need to draw some. Alright, we're good. She goes first, and she might have a heal, so we better just kill it. There. And then... Spell there, I guess. And let's throw up... Uh, throw that up for some... We get some shielding out of that. We don't need to heal, though. Although we could put Bless on somebody. Yeah, let's throw Bless on him. Alright, what do you got for me? Ugh, stupid Merrick. Stupid, super slow. That's why that one needs to die. <laughs> Alright, we got all kinds of energy. <laughs> little heal there. Do barricade. Guess we'll, uh... We want to punch her? Yeah, let's punch her. Hit him. Guess we should probably just try to kill him, maybe. Probably the play. Probably what I should have been doing. Oh well. So let's dispel those stupid marks. Yeah, we're fairly uh, we're fairly well shielded here. I don't think I have to worry about that. Well, better get some more shielding. <laughs> All right. So front monster mark, ricochet front monster. Okay. Can we finish off this front monster? Gonna be close. Yep, that should work. Bleed should finish it off. Unless he has a heal or some kind of buff. Which is possible. Alright, what do we got here? Yeah, we will we'll get rid of that fire blast and we'll keep everything else. Yeah, that's what I was scared of. That's not a big deal. Not a big deal. Oh no, he's still bled to death. 
Oh, it must have been shield, not block, was it? I guess I wasn't paying close enough attention. Okay, so now what we want to do? Well, it's Ember Storm. It's free. Free. That's free. Fireball him, I guess. He has so much fire resist. Maybe hit her with that. Drop her resist. Then do fireball. Ah, I'm gonna hit him. Nice to kill her, though. Yeah, can we kill her? Gonna be close. He's not gonna take all 15 damage, right? No, we're not gonna kill her. That's fine, though. Not a big deal. More slows. Yeah, they don't they shouldn't get another turn. Now let's do a deflect. Oh, now we're getting like all our expensive stuff. <laughs> um let's do that. And that, I guess. Should have done that first. Oh, it's ran. Oh, sweet. Once it died, it switched over. Can we finish him off? Probably. Well, he's taking 28 fire damage. I think we'll be okay. How much damage is this bludgeon going to do? 10, 14, 18. So that's what, 42 damage? That's pretty good. Transmission, huh? I did to take that. Spell made the condemnation. That's pretty expensive. But decay is nice. Decay is nice. Can you get oh it does get cheaper? We're not worried about applying dark so much. Yeah, I'm gonna take that and then we'll upgrade it. I'm gonna take the train. Oh, what are they? said I was going to take it, and then I clicked on the shards because I'm smart. <laughs> uh, okay, we're going to take transmission. Here, transform, bleed into poison. Nah, we don't have any stanza, but that's pretty amazing. If you do have a stanza deck, I'm going to have to try a song deck someday. Cover three range attack, place one in your hand, cost reduced by one. Hmm. Yeah, let's take that. Why not? All right, boss time. Before we get to the boss, though, if you're enjoying this video, please leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Join my Discord. Follow me on Twitch. Follow me on Twitter. All right, so we can fight against hatred, to the front, malice, and arrogance. Or we can heal. We don't need to heal. I do not know which one to put at the front. I don't know which one's which. All I know is the first turn, this one's going to taunt. And then this one's going to taunt. And then this one's going to taunt. So you got to kind of cycle through. You hope to do enough damage to kill, right? We will see. So I'll hit him with a pommel. Obviously, we don't have a choice. I'll hit him with this. Not great damage, but that's because his resists are 60%. So I'll have to get that down. But we will. We'll work that down. All right, got some block up and whatnot. See, that'll work down. <laughs> the old, uh, whatchamacallit. Uh, resists. Got them down a bit, so all right, let's uh, get some marks on the go as well. Yeah, ricochet, I guess. All right, let's use this ammunition. Place one in my hand. Costs one less. Does it one less? Like, is that already... Ranged attacks are already one less for me, so we're both... Yes, that is reflecting both of the one lesses. 
We I should have done that first. Now we don't have enough. <laughs> Alright, let's do explosive shot. No. We only have three. And if we want to do this, I guess we'll have to do poison spray. Should have used that first. Could have better spent my energy. Alright, so random monster, when there's a taunt, just goes to that one. <laughs> Obviously. Alright, so he's invulnerable. That's fine. Hopefully we can do some serious damage to this one. We got two turns to do it. Yeah, this is not a great hand. But his fire resists are pretty low. He's going to take a pounding here, actually. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, so now we can start on this one, I guess. Maybe the back one, while we have the chance. Alright, so we'll draw an extra card, have an extra energy here. Get some heals on the go, hopefully some dispels. Yeah, oh yeah, we got a couple dispels. Who do we want to dispel here? Dispel you, I guess. Buffer. Who do we want to heal? Uh, spell and heal you. Heal there. Holy smite. Ooh, that's a lot of resist. So, so let's hit him with that. Expect <laughs> to prophecy. Draw four. Place one. Oh, we do not need all these heals. <laughs> Put you on top. And we will cast prayer protection. We finish the turn. But no, that turn went well. You you just want to make sure you can kill one every turn, right? Is ultimately the goal with these things. As long as you're killing one a turn, you're doing you're doing well. So now this one has taunts. So now we gotta try to kill this one. What do we got? Let's start with a ricochet. Get uh, get a couple marks on him. Now everything else does extra. We don't have a whole lot of uh, energy though here. We can't do everything, that kind of sucks. But it's fine. Ooh, we got some options here. Pommel first, get a bunch of crack on him. And actually, let's. Who wants the bass? You, I guess. Draws me an extra card. Eh, heal. I'll actually probably save that. So let's do let's do a bludgeon. He's gonna <laughs> that. honestly, Magnus might be able to kill him all by himself here. Or do I want to wait and use this last? Hmm. No, I want to get as much uh, crack on him before I pulverize. I think it's a lot of damage. Oh yeah, it's taking a yeah, it's it's having a bad time, <laughs> and it's dead. Awesome. <laughs> this crack deck is pretty good. All right, so now this one's vulnerable, so I know who we're hitting. It's one at the back. Oh, I drew all my non-fire stuff. Ember Storm. Searing Touch. Well, we don't need to heal, so let's just Shadow Bolt. And Fire Blast. Yeah, we're starting to stack up some fire. We won't be able to kill him this turn, though. Unless we draw, like, the best hand ever. No. I mean, it's not bad. We'll do some damage for sure. Boom bolt is nice. Would have been nicer earlier. But some nice things. Yeah, we're going pretty well here. Yep. Oh, this is Well, we didn't expect to struggle here. The struggle is going to be when we get to the fire area and all our fire stuff does very little all of a sudden right that's that's when we get in trouble so we hit that oh it's immune to poison though 
So let's ricochet. Shrapnel shot. Beam shot, I guess. That's all I got. That should be fine, though. He should die. Ooh, that's some rage. Ooh, definitely piercing how. Love piercing how. See, this would have been amazing <laughs> last turn. I mean, still is. So let's get some, uh, let's get some crack on him. Watch how much damage this does. So this, should, in theory, should do 28 damage, right? Not going to do 28 damage. It's going to do a lot more than that because of all the cracks. And there'll be more cracks every time. 18, 20, 23, 26, 28. Yeah. <laughs> if you haven't tried the crack damage on your tank, I highly recommend it. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. And now you die. Well, I mean, he dies on his turn regardless. <laughs> but we'll put him out of his misery here if we can. Later. Perfect. No, this, that went pretty well. I was expecting it to go pretty well, though, to be fair. Ground slam. Ooh. 15 to all monsters. Three crack and two vulnerable. That's amazing. Oh, but Pulverize is good, too. And Pulverize is already upgraded. That's great. What does this upgrade to? An extra crack, an extra damage. Three crack, two damage, but you can only use it once. I'm going to take it. All right, what do we got here? Range attack. Oh, I love Vulnerable. I love Vulnerable so much. Taking it. <laughs> and then... Hmm... I want to take one of these. Oh, they're, so, they're too expensive. And for him, that's too expensive. Renew is nice. Set upgrade to... Grant 6, heal 8. Yeah, that's, that's actually kind of pricey for what it does. So I'm just going to take the shards, I think. Yeah. Golden chest. 300 gold, 300 shards, some experience, four upgrade materials. Nice. What do we got here? Hydra egg. Immune to poison, max HP plus 10. Every two turns, all heroes gain five regen. That's pretty good. Gladiator helmet. All resistances, 18%. That's nice. Combat start. Oh, fury. Yeah, fury's good. If you, can, if you get an item that makes you immune to bleed... Fury is like crazy good. I don't know if I want it though, because I don't have that in this deck. Twin Blades, no. Max HP plus 10 for every water you apply. Apply one poison. I can see where that would be good, but it's not in our current deck, I don't think. Storm Tierra. All resistance is 4%. Lightning damage plus 1. Lightning and water charges plus 1. Okay, I see where that would be good, but it's not what we're going for. Titan Gauntlets, max HP plus 30. Immune to Disarm, which is nice. Every turn, gain 3 powerful. Wow, we're going to consider that. For him, maybe? Yeah, we're, he's taking that. Steadfast Boots, all resistance is 18%. Speed plus 1. So we're going to give this to him, because we want him to get more speed. And this, all max HP plus 25, all resistance is 6%. I think that's probably an upgrade to what I have for him. Of course, it's an upgrade there too, probably. <laughs> it's an upgrade for a few people, I think. Yeah, it's an upgrade for pretty much everybody. <laughs> but I'm going to give it to my tank. Yeah. Yep. And then him, he will take the gauntlets. And he will take the Steadfast Boots. And he, I don't think, will take anything. Because I like the Brigand Armor quite a bit. It would be nice to take this just to unlock it. But no, I'm going to take the money. Take the money and run. Let me know in the comments if you would have done that differently. I'm in front of the Obelisk. Like to snap the Obelisk. This one is activated and brimming with energy. 
As you did before, you read the obelisk runes aloud. The obelisk wall warps and distorts, creating new portal. The portal's reddish and hot air comes out of it. Let's cross the reddish portal. Alright. Valkarath Mountains, let's go. Alright, let's dip into town here. Can we do any town upgrades? Cost of transforming cards, cost of curing injuries. Yeah. I'm gonna save up for some of this higher stuff, I think. Alright, is there any good items in here? Hmm. That's interesting. No, I don't think I'm going to take any of these. Which means... Alright, so... We gotta look at Cornelius' deck here. We gotta seriously consider removing some, some of this fire stuff and replacing it with... The question is, what are we going to replace it with, right? <laughs> I mean, let's see here. Do we want to spend the resources it would take to just completely overhaul his deck? Oh my god, that's expensive. Nine. When would you ever have nine? I mean, it does 125 damage. But holy crap. Well, I could buy... What do they call it? A, curse, a couple of Curse of Elements. Now let's buy two of those. We'll get rid of the flares and we'll put them in. And what else? Shadow? Maybe grab some shadow stuff? And can we flip over? Ooh, I like this. I'm going to buy two of those. I'm kind of going to kind of make him into a bit of a support mage. So everything has fire resist. So what could we do here? What could we grab that costs zero? Well, these essentially cost zero. We're going to keep this stuff. We're going to get rid of the flares. We're going to get rid of the fireballs, or at least this fireball. All right, so let's do that. Let's remove some cards here. So we're going to get rid of the flares. I'm going to get rid of this one fireball. We're going to get rid of a couple of these fire blasts for sure. So stack's down to 20. It's a little pricey though right now. Oh, we got more. Make sure we upgrade that transmission. All right, let's actually do... Let's do an advanced divination. Premium division, divination would be nice, but I want to hold on to some money. For removing cards. Oh my goodness. Deal 28 and apply 4 crack. Now what's it upgrade to? Any monster. Back, back monster only is interesting though. I'm actually going to take that. For him, I'm taking a ricochet. For him, deal 3 and 3. Repeat up to 3 times. Pay one extra energy to repeat. No, we'll skip. Oh, that thing. Yeah, we're going to skip that. What is Nightmare? Apply one and one. Not in this deck, I don't think. Purge one. Does upgrade to Purge two. No, we're going to take shards. As much as that, in it does interest me. going to be honest. All right, so Andrin, I want to get rid of what? Burning shots. Burning shots are expensive. We already we already kind of replaced it with a with a ricochet. But what else could we replace it with? We want some range stuff. We want to get a little cheaper if we can as well. So we're a little expensive right now. I think I might get rid of this rupture too. So let's uh let's go out. Let's go in here. Get rid of the burning shots. Trying to get out of trying to get out of the fire deck game. Get rid of the rupture. We just added the ricochet. So most of this stuff is actually cheaper. This this is the exception, but like these are actually only one. That's two. That's three. That's four. 
Aim shot. So let's see what we can get for or him that cost a base of two and is a ranged attack. Preferably. Poisonous shot. I mean, we could get another ricochet. No, we don't want too many ricochets because, like, if we're ricochets, kind of, kind of sucks against a single boss, right? What I would like is oh, another shrapnel shot. It is <laughs> for sure. Yeah, another shrapnel shot. Yeah, okay, I like that deck. All right now for him, if we're gonna get rid of these sunbeams, which I think we will. We need to replace it with some damage of some sort. That's cheap, preferably. Black Karma. Um, healing spell. Or we could just, you know, focus more on healing, I guess. Yeah, I could go for a couple flashes. I mean, they're cheap, right? And a flash heal. Another dispel, maybe? What I would like is something that applies debuffs. Right? Like, uh... Like, uh, well, that's not what I was thinking. I was thinking of this, Ruin Bolt. Guess it's too rare. We can't buy it. But yeah, I would love another Ruin Bolt. It does not appear to be an option. Unfortunately. Vile Lance isn't bad either. Especially once you make it cheaper. I just like the slow, right? So let's get a Vile Lance here. Then get, let's get rid of the Sunbeams. His deck is big though, 25 right now. Yeesh. All right, no, that's, I think that's good enough. I mean, we still have some fire stuff, but we got rid of a lot of it. All right, so how much upgrading can we do? All right, so we can do another, yeah, let's do another advanced divination, get some extra shards. Um, nothing here we want. No, so we're gonna take the shards. Yeah. Uh, detection is nice. Neurotoxin, no. I've heard about this though. If you're going with a poison deck, this is amazing. I, a buddy of mine said he did over 200 damage with this card. I believe it. So we're just gonna, ah, detection is nice though. Two marks on everybody, just one. That's already upgraded though. How big is this deck? 23. Yeah, we're going to take the detection. Deal three, apply two. All monsters. That's already upgraded, right? Yeah. Just going to take the shards. Another panacea? Yeah. Alright, let's see what we can upgrade here. First of all, we're going to upgrade transmission to make it cheaper. Transmission at a cost of two is kind of borderline unplayable. Uh, let's make you do extra damage and an extra crack. And you. What about this? Yeah, do, 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 do. Now let's do that one. Do I want to keep both fireballs? I feel like I should get rid of one of the fireballs. Okay, we're definitely upgrading Flash. Make that one free. Make this one draw a card. Prepare protection. Do we want to upgrade that? Vile Lance, we're definitely upgrading. We're going to make that cheaper. That's mostly for the slow. Panacea is an expensive upgrade. But man, this is a nice one. Two buffer. Heals 23. It goes away, but that's okay. Alright, what about stuff we put in his deck? 
So let's do the ricochet, get the marks. Or ricochet is probably not a great idea, honestly. <laughs> uh, so we'll do this upgrade for this one. We will make one go away. We was, so we're running out of shards here. Ooh, we can make it cheaper. Our deck is pretty pricey right now. We can make this cheaper. Does build really less damage though. Well, I can only upgrade one thing. I want to upgrade to the black. No, they're fine as there. So I can do the poison spray, lethal shot, or the fire shot. The lethal shot we can't make cheaper. The other two we can. I'm gonna make this cheaper because I feel like at five, which is reduced to four, but even then it's borderline unplayable, right? Yeah, let's do that. Because we didn't even touch <laughs> Magnus' deck. Oh, we probably should have upgraded some of those. Should have upgraded the bludgeon. Yeah, I should have paid more attention to Magnus' deck. Ground slam. Yeah, mistakes were made. Alright, that's fine. I'm pretty happy with my deck, though, overall. So, uh, let's get after it. Let's get after it. Alright, which way do we want to go here? We don't have any quests for here. This is a rare event, so let's do that. Let's go that way. Well, that's like a card note, I think it's called. Yeah, no, I'm going to do the rare event. Extreme Corruption. All monsters gain plus 7 fire and crushing damage. Immune to flame and crack. No, we're not doing it. They're immune to crack. Yeah, this would be crazy. That's, yeah, no thank you. <laughs> no thank you. Alright, so what do we got here? Well, obviously we're going to pommel. And then we will... Fortunately, we can't do everything, which sucks. Let's bludgeon. This will do some good damage. We'll punch him. And then we will uh, get some block up. Can't can't do the other thing, unfortunately, but, you know, life goes on, right? So let's uh, Hunter's Mark. Deflect, draw a card. That shrapnel shot. That's a lot of cracks. <laughs> so let's ammunition here. Now oh, it's explosive. Uh, ricochet, but it doesn't have the upgrade. Let's actually explosive shot. Because well, these guys, they have some flame resist, but not crazy. Like later on, they have like crazy fire resists. Yeah, let's just cast this, get, get it out of the deck. Ow. Oh well, they all get a turn. Oh, I should have crafted I should have crafted the card that gives everybody on the team haste. Yeah, that's a mistake on my part. Ow. Well, I got some healing to do, it looks like. <laughs> Alright, so let's um hmm. Oh well Ember Storm is free, so let's do that. This is free, so let's do that. And, uh... Let's cast this. Yeah, that works for me. You want to do that on him? Sure. And hit him with that. Yeah, he's pretty much dead. So we'll focus on healing here. Mostly healing Cornelius. <laughs> Actually, we're pretty full now, healing-wise. So let's hit this guy. Get some. De Actually, getting debuffs on him isn't great because we only get one turn before he does. So let's draw some cards here. So what do I want to put back on top? Flash. We're gonna cast. No, 
Cast Panacea will get one mana back. Let's put Benediction back. We can take that next turn. So we'll Healing Ring. And we'll Panacea on... Oh, I was hoping to dispel the slow, but he had too many things on him. Oh, well. We'll do that. And we end up drawing the Benediction back. So do they have any healers, I wonder? Yeah, we can't finish them off anyway. I'm going to count on the dots to kill them, though. Actually, I'm likely to... Between these two, we're going to draw something that's probably monster only, probably. Or we'll draw, like, three ricochets. <laughs> and I'm sure one of them's going to hit. So let's, uh... Let's try to kill this one so it doesn't get a turn. Oh, are neither of the ricochets going to go to him? Nope, apparently not. And we didn't quite kill. Oh, no, the fire should kill him. Yeah, so he's dead. But nice knowing you. Ooh, Piercing Howl is perfectly timed. Now they don't get a turn. Oh, let's punch him to death. And then pommel. Pommel. And heal him, I guess. Doesn't really matter. Intercept there. Bear armor there. Perfect. Alright, so we can kill one of them for sure, I'm pretty sure. Well, we'll Ember Storm first, because it's free. Or do we want a fireball here? What has their fire resist? Their fire resist is pretty good. Either way, we're going to transmission the healer after we do whatever we're going to do. Yeah, let's fireball. It's the most total damage, I feel like. Alright, Reggie. You need to do, like... 11 damage, I would say. Not with that hand, you're not going to... Oh, no, he will. <laughs> Just barely. All right, so let's dispel you. And uh, heal nobody. Fair protection. Barricade. And turn. Oh, he didn't die. Oh, wait. Why did he die in? Did I have poison on him? I didn't think he had poison. Must have. I don't know, something... Girls. Anyway, we're full health, so let's just finish them off here. I'll poison spray. I'll do a number on them. Ow. 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 Yeah, that's a lot of poison. <laughs> Surely Magnus can do... No, we don't need to do damage. Dots will kill him. There we go. Beautiful. Big win. Okay, right, what have we got? Colossal Blow. Front monster. Deals 29. Ignores block. That is nice. Ooh. Gain two. Is that buffer? No, that's powerful. I think I'm just going to choose shards. His deck's in a pretty good spot right now. I don't really want to play with it a whole lot. Poisonous shot I could take. No, let's just go shards again. Ring Nightmare. Five, five. Fly. Repeat up to three. No, let's just take shards. And shards. That's not a bad card. It's an upgrade too. Yeah, I mean, I'm gonna take it. Inspire's pretty good. And let's see what this rare event is. Raider Patrol. Bordering the cliff, you see a man with the appearance of a merchant running in a hurry. A few meters from him, a patrol of goblin raiders is chasing him and will catch him shortly. If you wish to intervene, you can attempt a quick ambush, but failing may result in the merchant being killed before you can react. Leave. Face the raiders head on without wasting time. Or try to hide and attack at the right time. Lower than six. I feel like... Eesh. Because, like, I have all this stuff that it's cheaper, but I don't think that applies. I mean, I do have some zero-cost stuff, but, like, his deck's pretty expensive. Like, 
all I have to do is draw one of these threes or fours, and it's pretty much toast, right? He's got some threes. He's got some threes. No, I'm just going to have to do this combat. We see you coming and prepare to fight. The merchant has time to escape and take our gun. That's all we wanted. I wanted to make sure the merchant survived. Alright, so, okay, he has melee resists. Actually, they all have pretty good melee resists. Alright, so let's, uh, Ommo. Yeah, ground slam, everybody. And we'll pummel the front guy. Oh, <laughs> it's a lot of damage. And defend. And call it a turn. Black to draw some cards. To black to draw some cards. It's ammunition. What do we got here? Rain of arrows. All monsters for 15 repeat twice. Yeah, let's do that. So let's def uh, detection first. Then we'll rain of arrows. That's a lot of damage. Like... A lot of damage. I know I, I know I just said that, but that's a lot of damage. <laughs> and I'm actually, eh, probably could have cast that. Anyway, that's a pretty good turn, though. <laughs> so they're all going to get a turn, but I'm going to willing to bet that they don't get many turns. Well, I guess I'm healing to do now. So he's going to die. He's not going to get a turn. All these little guys will, but I guess they put some block up. Oh, and they are evade. They do have evasion. Well, he had evasion. <laughs> Alright, what are we looking at here? Oh, we got all... Let's hit some fireballs. Or a fireball. And we'll do a searing touch. Get rid of his evasion. And we will... Curse of Elements front guy. I'll do him. And we'll scroll of intellect the healer. Eh, probably get a scroll of intellected ranger. Alright, so we got some options here. It's healing rain. Get some heal over times. We'll panacea him. And I'm gonna panacea him too. Not for the heals, but for the dispels. We still got three left, so we can do a prayer protection. Or do we wanna just do damage? Try to get them dead. No, we're gonna. I'm gonna prayer protection because we're not gonna be able to kill them all. I can get one dead for sure, maybe two, but not all three, unless I draw like incredibly well, which I didn't. Yeah. So what do we want to do? Just ricochet, I guess. And smoke bomb with an aim shot thrown in for good measure. Yeah, I'm spreading my damage around too much. Oh well. So I got five here. So let's piercing how first. Doesn't really help a whole lot. And then we're gonna do a bass, heal him. Then what do we want to do? So we got a lot of front monster only stuff. So let's hit him with that. Pulverize him or bludgeon him. Punch first. 17, 22 is 39. So then, then yeah, then we can pulverize and that kills. Then we can bludgeon and then pulverize. Wait, will this bludgeon kill? Eat twice. It's going to be close. Yeah, we wait. That was front monster only. Otherwise, I just would have let him. He would have died to dots. But hey, we killed two. I'm happy. He can't do a whole lot, right? And we don't need to heal or anything, right? And there goes his evasion. We can do that for free. Do that for free. And then do a Shadow Bolt. Yeah. Perfect. And do we draw any damage? Yeah. Draw a card. Get some more regen. Draw some more cards. 
I'll put that back since I can't cast it anyway. Do some more damage. Let him let him draw an extra card. And we don't need to heal. Oh, we got some more damage there. Perfect. And now we kill him. And you're dead. Perfect. Alright, what are we looking at here? Mm, grant X. X equals your deck times four. It's an awfully expensive, though. It's a little too expensive. But man, that could be a lot. <laughs> a block. Now let's take the shards. Hit and run? No. Gain one. Reveal three. Song? No. I do gotta try a song deck one of these days, but it's not this day. Ooh, I like this. I like applying vulnerable. Yeah, let's take that. Even though it's, it's hard to cast this stuff. I can cast my fire stuff, but not much else. Ooh, slow? I like slows. Ooh, we can upgrade it to days instead of slow. I don't know. I might not have a chance to upgrade stuff, though, so... How big is this deck? 26. I better not. I better take shards. Alright, so I just realized this video is 46 minutes long, so uh, we're going to end it here. Well, let's... Uh... Wait, wait, wait. Hold up. He killed all the Golden Raiders who were chasing the merchant. The Grateful Merchant explains he has had to throw away most of his merchandise to run faster, but as a reward, he gives you a small bag of gold and a VIP card. He tells you that showing that card in some stores will give you special treatment. So I can take the gold and the card and leave. Or you ask if he's got something left for sale, but I gotta go higher than five. Let's try it. I was scared I couldn't get under six. <laughs> Fail. Oh, we get the card. Oh, we still get the gold and the card. So perfect. All right. Now, that's all for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a like. Subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Twitch, Twitter, all that good stuff. Okay, so this is where we want to go with our card. So we'll go there. Anyway, have a great day. Be good to each other. And I'll see you in the next one.